This week we're talking about coated jeans and jumpers. So it seems a bit ridiculous to make a fashion video about how to wear jeans and jumpers because obviously everybody knows how to wear jeans and jumpers but actually we all wear jeans and jumpers a lot in the winter and it does change, the look does change every year. Um, a couple of years ago it was all about how ripped your jeans were and then a very simple jumper and then last year it was all about your statement Christmas jumper. So this year there is a new jeans and jumper look as there always is. Um, now on the back of the rise of the leather jean as a kind of stealth item that is encroaching on the normal wardrobe, the coated jean has become um, a bigger staple of all the kind of denim and trouser departments in all the high street stores. Um, it's a lot cheaper than leather and it looks a bit smarter than jeans, so it's kind of in between, it's a kind of jeans leather hybrid, so that's where we are. Now specifically this week, uh, we're talking about coated jeans and jumpers because the coated jeans are quite a full-on look. They are a bit oily and uh, a bit kind of glammy and you can wear them out on a Saturday night with a little sparky top if you want. That's up to you. But uh, I'm talking about at the moment, I think we can only really bring them into the fold with a jumper and that kind of takes the edge off the whole look at my shiny bottom side of things. Um, so we've got quite a few coated jeans and jumpers here to show you today. Topshop, who are always a good go-to place for a nice jean, are doing these Lee jeans, which is very much the classic sort of Baxterish shape, but in a nice um, coated texture, which is a quite a matte one. You can't really see the difference. It doesn't screen the shine at you from a long way away. So it's quite a good everyday coated jean. Um, these ones here are current Elliot, and um, this is a much more proper rock and roll look, sort of halfway between a leather jean and a legging really, as shiny as leather, but very, very thin, so you won't get quite so hot. These ones here are Oasis. They kind of hold a color really well, these kind of pigments looks more natural in these often than it does in a coloured denim, so it's quite good. Another good point about coated jeans is they're basically wiped clean, so uh, mothers of small children are actually surprisingly partial to these jeans because all the sticky stuff that gets wiped in your legs wipes straight off. These ones here are Oasis, and um, I quite like this look. They have a kind of banknote kind of foil to them, these ones, that just picks up the sheen as if you've kind of, I don't know, rolled in gold somewhere. And then the last pair of jeans are these ones, which are kind of fabulous sort of starburst navy with a full-on glitter to them. Now, jumpers to wear with jeans, again, I am completely sure you're capable of working this out yourself, but there are a few nice jumpers here, so you might as well have a look. Um, this one from Cos is quite a good option because, as you can see, it's very long. It's practically a sweater dress, um, which, if you're not that confident about the idea of your thighs in these jeans then this gives you quite a good cover-up look and it's a bit like you're wearing the leggings underneath. This sweater here by Vanessa Bruno Athe is just a really gorgeous comfy cozy material which I think is quite nice for offsetting uh, the slightly alarming urban edge of a coated jean so if you put it like with that then it's a Sunday lunch in the country time. And lastly this one from Zara, which is uh, possibly your go-to high street store for knitwear, I'd say, this season. Zara, so many beautiful jumpers. This is just one to look at today.